Hey guys, I'm just doing a quick video on how to update your S2100 Spectrum Smart Charger. Uh, you're unfortunately going to have to go on to Facebook. You don't need an account to do this. You just need to search up Horizon Hobby on Facebook and you will find this post and you're going to have to expand the little chat box there. You'll see I click see more and then uh, the update link is there. There's not a direct link off Google for some reason. I couldn't find it. So this is the update page. If you scroll down, it's two pages. You're gonna see me scroll down here and you are going to see all the chargers that can currently be updated. Also, if you look in the top left of that page, it says December 1st, 2020. So you know it's the most current update. Here's, my tr here's what the new update looks like on the S2100 charger. I'm sure most years don't look like this, at least mine didn't. Mine is about a year old, so I mean maybe some current ones have the newest update. I'm going to scroll through the settings here and um, show you what update I'm running. Right here in system info. So if yours is already running that, then don't worry about this video. If not, this is how you update it. So back to this link. You're going to click download. You see me downloading here on the bottom left. It's downloading there. Now, keep in mind, I've already done this update. You saw my charger. so. Um, but the steps will be the same regardless if you have, haven't done it. So right here, I'm going to open the, uh, the download. And I'm going to show you. You have to open that folder and then see that right there. I'm trying to focus. You're going to have to extract there. So you basically just click it and it's going to ask you to extract. Extract all. Now it's going to say replace because I've already done this. So for me, I'm just going to replace for you and just automatically extract. You open it up again. Now it's this purple icon. You're going to double click that. And then it's going to say that it's like protected. Just click more info because it doesn't want you to run it, but you're going to run it anyways. It's fine. Don't worry. It's not. Uh, it's not going to be harmful to your computer, so this is the update tab. As you can see, if you're wondering what the update does, this is what the update does. It's it's there. I'm not going to read it out for you guys. I'm just doing a quick tutorial here. At the bottom, in the red, it uh, was showing that it's not connected. This is the connection cable, so you are going to need to buy this from Horizon Hobby or from your local hobby shop if you want to update your charger. Uh, it is a USB to like auxiliary core I don't even know it's really strange but uh, anyways the the headphone jack part goes into the charger and the other piece goes into your laptop not the other way around uh, don't put the headphone piece into your laptop and then the USB into the charger it's yeah the other way so once you're connected you see on the bottom of the screen it's gonna go green showing it's connected I'm gonna just reopen it again to show you but look at the bottom middle you see how it was red and then it went green right there um, so now that's how you know it's connected then you just click update and then you'll see on your screen it'll prompt you that it's updating it doesn't take long and that's it that's how it's done um, one thing to note is once it's updated you need to unplug it for like 30 seconds and kind of do like a reset so i'm just doing that now because once i did update it i plugged in my 2s battery and it was registering as a 5s and i thought oh crud the update messed up my charger but it didn't it just needed to be turned off and turned back on so here i'm plugging in the 2s and you can see this is kind of a new update and what it does so as soon as you plug in your battery it wants to start charging right away it's basically like you know uh making it as simple and easy as possible so you because basically typically you know you plug in a battery you charge it so it just automatically starts charging it Unfortunately, I don't know if you can turn that off if you don't want that feature, but uh, you're going to see here if you just press and hold the menu button, you can just stop it from charging, which I do. And that's pretty much the just of the update. I'm going to scroll through some menus and uh, just show you what the new update looks like. Uh, again, as for features, just read the, uh, the download page there. It'll tell you all the new features of the new update, but... I didn't see any videos like this on the internet, so hopefully this helps anyone that's looking to update their Spectrum S2100 smart charger or any of the other smart chargers. Thanks, bye.